Welcome to Sprint Spotlight, your ultimate destination for all things track and field. Today we're diving into the top 10 most inspiring comeback stories in track and field history. These athletes have faced incredible challenges, from devastating injuries to personal setbacks, and have risen above them to achieve greatness. Their stories are a testament to the human spirit, determination, and the never give up attitude that defines true champions. So let's get started and celebrate these amazing athletes who have triumphed over adversity. Starting off our list at number 10 is Derek Redmond from Great Britain. The 1992 Barcelona Olympics provided one of the most emotional moments in sports history. Redmond was a favorite in the 400 meters, but disaster struck in the semifinal when he tore his hamstring. Determined to finish the race, Redmond hobbled towards the finish line. In a heartwarming display of support, his father jumped onto the track to help him. Together, they crossed the finish line, creating an unforgettable moment of courage and perseverance. Redmond's story remains a powerful example of determination and the unwavering support of family. At number nine, we have Gail Devers from the USA. In the late 1980s, Devers was diagnosed with Graves' disease a severe thyroid condition that almost ended her career. She suffered from extreme weight loss, fatigue, and swollen feet that nearly required amputation. Despite these challenges, Devers made an incredible comeback. In 1992, she won the gold medal in the 100 meters at the Barcelona Olympics, followed by another gold in 1996 in Atlanta. Devers' perseverance and remarkable recovery showcased her incredible resilience and determination, making her one of the most inspiring athletes in track and field. Good, and as they come toward the last hurdle, Devers, Linda Good, and Cheryl Dickey, one, two, three. Coming in at number eight is Wilson Kipsang from Kenya. After a disappointing 2012 London Olympics, where he finished third in the marathon, Kipsang faced numerous personal and professional challenges. However, he didn't let these setbacks define him. Kipsang made a stunning comeback by breaking the marathon world record in Berlin in 2013, finishing with a time of 2 hours, 3 minutes, and 23 seconds. Gewinnt den Weltrekord! 2.03.22, die neue Marke! His resilience and ability to bounce back after setbacks have inspired many in the running community, proving that persistence and hard work can lead to extraordinary achievements. At number 7, we have Castor Semenya from South Africa. Semenya's career has been marked by controversy and challenges related to her hyperandrogenism, a condition that causes elevated levels of testosterone. Despite facing immense scrutiny and unfair treatment, Semenya has shown incredible resilience. After being banned from competing in the 800 meters due to new regulations, she continued to train and compete in other events. Her unwavering determination and success on the track, including winning multiple gold medals, have made her an inspiration to many advocating for athletes' rights and gender equality in sports. Number six on our list is Tyson Gay from the USA. Gay's career faced a major setback in 2013 when he tested positive for a banned substance, resulting in a one-year suspension and the annulment of his results from July 2012 onwards. Despite this scandal, Gay made a remarkable comeback, returning to competition with determination and focus. He went on to win silver in the 4x100 meters relay at the 2016 Rio Olympics. Gay's story is a testament to the power of redemption and the ability to overcome personal mistakes to achieve greatness. Doing Tyson Gay is going to take him this time. Gay wins, bolt in second, a 983, a new meeting record. Halfway through our countdown at number five is Paula Radcliffe from Great Britain. Radcliffe, a marathon world record holder, faced significant challenges during her career, including injuries and health issues. After a disappointing finish at the 2004 Athens Olympics due to a stress fracture, many doubted her ability to return to the top. Private battle now. Archie stopping, Paula Radcliffe has stepped off the track. However, Radcliffe made an incredible comeback, winning the New York City Marathon in 2004 and the London Marathon in 2005. Her resilience and determination to overcome adversity have made her one of the greatest marathon runners of all time. 
Paula Radcliffe becomes the world champion at last. At number four, we have Lu Xiang from China at the 2004 Athens Olympics, becoming the first Chinese man to win a track and field gold. Lu's determination to come back saw him return to competition and win gold at the 2010 Asian Games. He's the second man in the history of China to win an Olympic medal. Coming in at number three is Allison Felix from the USA. Felix's illustrious career seemed at risk when she underwent an emergency C-section at 32 weeks to deliver her daughter in 2018. The complications from childbirth and the demands of motherhood posed significant challenges for her athletic career. However, Felix made an extraordinary comeback, winning her 12th and 13th World Championship gold medals in 2019, surpassing Usain Bolt's record for the most gold medals by any athlete in World Championships history. Her journey as a mother and an athlete has inspired many, highlighting her incredible resilience, determination, and advocacy for maternal rights in sports. At number two, we have Oscar Pistorius from South Africa, known as the Blade Runner for his carbon fiber prosthetic legs. Pistorius made history by becoming the first amputee sprinter to compete in the Olympics, running in the 400 meters at the 2012 London Games. His journey was filled with legal battles and public scrutiny over whether his prosthetics gave him an unfair advantage. Despite these challenges, Pistorius' determination to compete at the highest level and his success in both the Paralympics and Olympics made him a symbol of overcoming physical adversity. His story, though later marred by legal troubles, remains a significant example of perseverance in the face of enormous challenges. All around the stadium, and Oscar Pistorius is the Paralympic champion of 2012 in London. And finally, at number one, we have Michael Johnson from the USA. Known for his unique running style and incredible speed, Johnson faced a major setback when he suffered a stroke in 2018. Despite the severity of his condition, Johnson was determined to make a full recovery. Through intense rehabilitation and sheer willpower, he defied the odds and regained his mobility. Johnson's comeback story is not just about his physical recovery, but also about his mental strength and determination to inspire others facing similar challenges. His journey from a devastating stroke to regaining his health and continuing to be a motivational figure in sports is a true testament to his character and resilience. Away from this field he goes, and he wins it. Perella comes through for second, Cardenas is third, as Jerome Young ties up. These comeback stories remind us that true champions are not defined by their victories alone, but by their ability to rise after a fall. Each of these athletes faced incredible challenges, yet they persevered and returned stronger than ever. Their stories inspire us to push through our own obstacles, showing that with determination, resilience, and the right support, anything is possible. Now we want to hear from you. Which comeback story inspired you the most? Do you know of any other incredible comebacks in track and field that we missed? Let us know in the comments below. Your insights and stories are important to us and we love hearing from our community. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to Sprint Spotlight for more inspiring and in-depth content about track and field. Hit the notification bell so you never miss an update from us. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the top 10 most inspiring comeback stories in track and field. Stay tuned for more uplifting content, and we'll see you in the next video.